Hey, what's up, family? Today we back in the stew with another video, and this one we're gonna go over Supreme Week 13. Y'all already saw the title, so we're not really gonna talk about that. I feel like there's a couple pieces here and there that are actually kind of fire, so I'm gonna go ahead and discuss them with y'all today. If you're doing up enjoying this video, leave a like on it down below. Subscribe to the channel if you are new and would enjoy more of this type of content. I'm not gonna lie, I've been slacking on the tube a little bit, bro, and that's due to the fact that I feel like this shit is kind of stale, bro. I'm kind of doing Supreme content a lot, and I've been trying to shift it more and more but i don't know what's going on bro i feel like it's just comfortable to get in front of here and talk about the drop list i want to do different shit but i don't know what holds me back i feel like i just need some inspiration but leave a like subscribe to the channel let's get straight to it yeah but i'm not gonna lie i've been kind of lazy it's okay i've been focusing on my nori archives putting a little more focus into my brand you feel me just trying to do better things with my time but i promise y'all i'm gonna be back and back stronger than ever at the top of the list we got the repeat leather belt and it's looking pretty clean i'm not gonna lie to y'all this looks like something that i would use on a daily basis literally just has supreme going throughout it and it comes in three different colorways that black the olive and the red i feel like all these shits go hard honestly it's one of those pieces for the right price it makes sense because you will actually wear this if you're the type of person that wears belts personally i already have a cdg belt in black so if i were to go for this i'd probably just go for the olive because i know everybody gonna go for the red one or the black i'd probably just stick to the olive this is actually a banger item i want to see if it has any resell at all it's simple it's actually something that you could use let me know if y'all gonna be going for the belt in the comments but we do have two pieces from the bird Burberry collection releasing this week the two that didn't make it when they actually dropped the shit and it's the bucket hat which honestly the bucket hat ain't even that bad I feel like for the summertime it's not too bad bro not too bad I doubt I'd go for it to be honest I'd probably go for the camp cap before the bucket hat each of the hats come in three different colorways the bucket has the black tan and pink plaid then the camp cap has like this blue denim and you also have the two plaid colorways I like the black bucket hat and the denim camp cap Cap. those are my two favorite i can't see myself wearing the burberry plaid all day type shit it doesn't work out with my wardrobe if y'all been staying tuned to the channel i tried to tell y'all that there's gonna be a supreme malcolm x collection coming out and we actually have it releasing this week the roy de carava malcolm x t is releasing in four different colorways honestly i'd probably cop this shit in the black or the white just to keep it real simple neon and blue honestly don't make sense for this t in my opinion I feel like if they would have done an olive or some cream colors, you feel me? It just would have looked way cleaner. But hey, to each his own. Honestly, the only color I'd go for is the black. This is a clean tee and down the line, it will be worth something because it's Malcolm X, bro. It has something to do with history. Hey, you got to respect it. So honestly, this would be one of the pieces that I decide to go for. I say it's a cop. Let me know in the comments if y'all going to cop this or drop. We got the Star Fleece jacket releasing in three different colorways. Honestly, this shit is a banger i love this one in that cream exquisite low key i feel like it's perfect for spring fall some shit like that but it's about to be summertime and honestly i'm good on this jacket simply because of that i'd literally buy this and store it in a closet for like half a year and then wear it i don't really need a piece like that in my collection right now so we good on this one but it definitely is commendable i'd probably just pick it up in the cream or the black we got the fat tip jaguar camp cap this one comes in three colors with that graffiti inspired font going around the whole hat i feel like this one's okay but i already have too many supreme hats so it's probably one that i would stick away from let me know if y'all are feeling this one i feel like it's hit or miss if you like graffiti you'll probably like this if not it's probably a dub for you and hey i understand it bro it's okay we got that same design that was on the malcolm xt but on a hoodie this time it's cool comes in five different colorways favorite being that light teal purplish navy and then the black i think the orange is pretty cool as well but it's just too vibrant my one gripe with this hoodie is that on the front it literally has nothing bro nothing at all like doesn't have shit but supreme on the hood the whole front of this shit is blank i wish they would have put at least like a little supreme branding right here or fucking in the middle or something for the price that you paying for this shit but let me know if y'all fucking with this one in the comments i'm more so just like what it has on it i'm not really fucking with how they did it if that makes sense there's the chain stitch denim jacket this one's coming out in 
two colors and honestly they bugging on this one folks i'm not going for either or like they could hold both of these shits i'm not gonna lie to y'all these shits is doo doo bro doo doo let me know if this is something y'all rocking with in the comments at the end of the day my opinion your opinion we all have one we all should that's okay this shit is ass to me and that's cool bro like let me know if y'all gonna be going for that we got these full croc basketball shorts these come in three colors you got the lakers color there's this brown and teal with a hint of red color and then you got the black with the white honestly they can miss me with all these shits i'm not really the basketball short connoisseur so this ain't even on my radar at all bro like i wouldn't spend 160 on basketball shorts i'm spending max 30 dollars on some basketball shorts so i'm good on these right here but let me know if this is something y'all are interested in we gonna skip on these bitch now these cargo zip off cinch pants go so hard bro i spoke about these when i did my lookbook at the beginning of the season and my opinion has not changed these are releasing in three different colorways and my favorite part probably has to be the fact that you could turn these shits from cargo pants to cargo shorts that's nuts in my opinion you don't lose any branding none of that funny shit the cargo pockets are big on these i actually am rocking with these a lot bro if i wasn't going on vacay soon i'd probably go for these but i'm good bro i'm honestly not trying to spend 200 dollars on some shorts it just doesn't make sense but this is a beautiful pair of pants especially in that olive or the washed gray color these bitches is hard i honestly think these shits deserve to be number two on the list behind the belt let me know if y'all rocking with these zip off cargos we got the mississippi tee coming out this is basically a freedom marcher that roy decarava took a picture of and it ended up on a supreme shirt pretty much there's four different colorways for this tee i honestly think the black one speaks volumes it looks solid and if i were to go for this that would be the one that i would go for i would still rather have the malcolm x tee before this but i see where they went with this and roy decarava was around for some serious times gotta give you salute i'ma keep it trucking though. jaguar denim shirt is ever so ass there's like waves of supreme branding on this shit we good bro if you're gonna spend money on a denim shirt please don't let it be this one they sell ralph lauren ones with a little polo horse made out of denim at the thrift store for like ten dollars max bro don't spend 200 or 150 who am i to judge but i'm just saying there's way better ways to spend 150 dollars than on this shit right here so yeah bro we gonna skip that we do got the chain stitch pants same shit as the jacket but on some pants and honestly it's the same exact feeling you're gonna get from me these are still ass it don't matter if it's on a hat a carpet or a car bro this shit is ass period i feel like somebody gonna wear this shit with some cowboy boots that's the only way i see this working for somebody's wardrobe dumb shit's gotta go bro we got the ripstop hooded windshell jacket this one comes in three different colorways my favorite probably being that black one i feel like some of these items are beginning to get more ass and ass the more we go down this totem pole of assness black one is decent though you feel me if it's raining on a little spring day throw this bitch on it's like you got a little trash bag on but i still feel like you could do better bro like just know that there's something better out there than this shit right here so we gonna skip on it there's this multi arc beanie it basically has a bunch of different arc logos on it comes in four different colorways i honestly just like the tone of pink they use and the tone of yellow but the thing with me is i've bought so much supreme throughout these years that i just don't get fascinated by this shit no more and it's kind of an issue that i wanted to talk to y'all about but that's another topic for another day i haven't really bought supreme in months at this point and i don't even feel bad about it bro i don't know it's cool though but this one it's all right the beanie is all right i'm not even gonna consider hearts jaguar short sleeve literally has hearts all over it has the little supreme branding on it i just don't see anything special in this piece there's a lot of throwaway ass shit at the bottom of this list you got these dr martins basically have these spider webs on top of them bro on top of them yes i was actually at the doc store probably like a couple weeks ago and i saw some docs that i want to get definitely don't look like that shit right there i'm trying to get some docs and some rick owens too but these right here is not the docs i'm trying to rock honestly i want to see if there's something better they're gonna release because apparently there's more dr martin shit supposed to release this is just all we have so far but we have a couple more items to talk about one being the full croc football jersey this one comes in like four colorways we spoke about the shorts earlier and the jersey basically comes in similar colors there's one extra color on the jersey which is the white one it still has bro that 86 on the front supreme 86 on the back and the logos are 
made out of croc leather or some shit. There's this side logo five panel, comes in four different colorways. This one is ass. Once again, you are not amazed. I'm not amazed. We're seeing this shit together, bro. I'm honestly appalled, bro. This shit don't make no sense. And last up on this list, we got the multi arc crew neck. Same shit that was on the beanie, but this time it's on a crew neck. You guessed it right. This one comes in four different colorways. The colors do look a little bit different than what they are on the beanie, but it's basically the same concept. It has a bunch of arc logos going throughout it. It's at the bottom of the list for a reason. There's nothing special behind this one. It literally just says Supreme, 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 Supreme. So we good on this one. Honestly, this list is looking kind of mediocre. Once you get to the bottom half, there's a couple solid items towards the top of the list with the Burberry pieces, the belt coming out, the Malcolm XT fleece jacket go crazy. And then them cinch pants. Come on, bro. The zip off ones. Them shits is so cold, bro. But yeah, that pretty much does it for this drop list, man. If you did enjoy, leave a like on it down below. Subscribe to the channel. Show some love. We on road to 20K still. Join us because we on road. Comment down below your favorite piece that's releasing. Leave a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel. And with all that being said, man, I'm going to catch y'all on the next one. Peace. Stay up. And I'm out.